Guys, what is going on? What literally is going on in the Big Brother house? Sean, Sean is not disgracing Wami. How? Like, how did he get to this point, guys? So we heard where Sean was having conversation with Onyeka, guys. I will just explain in details, guys. This is detail breakdown exactly word by word what Sean said, right? So they were coming from the garden. Sean explaining to Onyeka what he observed about Wani, and he said, "Cause of your I don't care attitude, you are now making decisions that you normally wouldn't make, but." To me, it is now like every time you are emotional, you can't just, you know, trust your judgment because you can be pissed off or irritated. But it is very or it is every time you are going to be doing some dumb shit. Sean continued by saying that earlier she put her hand up around me and i was like hmm i can smell something whatever whatever i smelt her hand and it smelt like pee and i said to her ha onyekana responded to sean in this conversation and said i was there now you were like your hand smelled like pee she now put her hand on one handy's feet that was the most i heard sean replied her and said i smelled it sha, and it smelled like pee whatsoever i now said it could be me sha, like not me it would be my nose just saying so she won't feel bad guys i remember vividly in the morning wani and sean was not talking since yesterday to this morning they were not talking Chisoba sat close to where Wani X and he was eating, taking their breakfast in the morning. And Chisoba was like, Why is Sean not with you guys? He's always with you guys when you guys are eating. What what what's up? What's going on? And Wani said, We are not talking. Right? So from there, I actually perceived that there was issue, there was something wrong. Not only this evening, we are now hearing something different, like literally different. The reasons what Sean is just saying to Onyeka because they were actually on conversation over up to 20 to 30 minutes, guys. So, this is all the things that Sean disclosed. Now, you know, people are beginning to say online that oh, that means Ruti was actually right, that means Ruti was not wrong, calling them dirty, dirty girls and all that and stuff like that, guys. This is not me saying this, this is exactly what Sean said. You can go back to that video at the beginning to watch it again to get a an info of what I just explained if you're confused, right? Maybe you will hear it from another person's mouth, but this is exactly what Sean just said about Wani. Congratulations to Team Hat. Team Hat actually has won today Arena Task, sponsored by Power Oil. All right, so Team Hat is comprises of Checkers, Shatoria, and Radicals. Right, so they actually won today's task. A big congratulations to them for winning today. I am so happy for Radicals. At least they are able to win at least one tag since the show began yes this is their first ever win since the show began i am so happy for them and big brother has announced tj's you know um wife you know delivery and tj is now a father of a twin so congratulations to tj as well for that particular one and tj said big brother please can i just drink today i need to get a smooth i just want to have fun right so big congratulations to your winners you no know, team heart Shatoria, radicals and checkers guys all right so guys i said this before and i want to say it again chingwe might be pregnant because this is cassia and victoria talking about it and they said she has been sleeping and she has said it several times that she has not seen her period in the house and they were actually talking about it smiling and laughing teasing her and she did so cassia asked her have you told big brother about it or you should you are just you know trying to cover or please oh, make sure you go and let people that know so that if there's anything we can also help you we'll help you so uh they actually laughed at about it so i heard where you know Chinese said you people should calm down 
at least by next week i will be fine nothing is happening to me right now and they all laughed about it but for sure our smith are beginning to talk about it we all noticed it how she sleeps how weak she becomes every single day and couple the fact that you know she actually has been talking about it and you guys know what that means all right so the bond that has been happening between cassia and victoria it seems nobody has been talking about it and i find it very interesting because it is good that victoria is actually now having you know a time to talk to a particular person and she find a comfort in cassia she find it very easy to relate things with cassia and i saw them bond very well in the big brother house this bond has actually we have seen it i think i noticed them since uh, on sunday they have been so close and they have been bonding although since day one but since last week you know saturday sunday they became very close guys so i think i love what uh, i'm seeing in regards to these two people all right so there are other things that actually happen that i also want to talk about please guys what exactly is happening in the camp of nelly and suit because things are going on right now things are going on right now but before that let me talk about onyeka first onyeka has been trending and people are saying that anytime she's up for nomination or for eviction she comes to diary room and start crying that she's trying to drag for pity vote and all that that this is her strategy and people are saying they're not going to fall for it this time around but guys i don't know i can't say it's a strategy i can't know if she's you know craving for pity vote that i can't tell but i've noticed it as well that she do cry almost all the time why can't you just at least once in a while come to the diary room and just talk normal like and just leave because she's always trying her best not to not to listen but people that actually advise that they please listen to your sister all the time because your sister is always advising you and you're not listening so people that actually you know advise that today and i hope she listens right so what is happening in the camp of nelly and Suge? guys chingwe has been broadcasting it since morning even from diary room that there is a time that Suj actually approached him approached her chingwe of zion guys so she said she's not even only the, she's not the only one that the guy has approached that she also approached other girls like ruthie and other girls and the person is with another person right now in the house which nelly heard it and called to far you know anita to the garden and asked them if they were actually part of or if they heard something like that or if Suj or Tofa is part of like if Suj and Tofa is really uh you know in that circle that she because she the way she said it looks like she's directing it to her and she felt like she's embarrassed in everything that she heard and coming to ask your one and only Suj Suj said that truly she actually said that to her at the beginning of the show but he never meant it that he was just joking how true is this guys now they are not talking really well i saw where she was trying to touch her and she just you know told to to just you know please leave me that kind of action or that, that kind of mood so this is the situation on ground in this ship what do you think i said it before that this ship is not going anywhere it's not lasting it's not real to me so give me your comment at the comment section while well, i'll see you guys in my next one